Hi, I'm David with Make, and I'm really excited to share with you the new Raspberry Pi 2 Model B. All right, let's break into this box and see the new Pi. Here we go. Great. So here we go. This is the new Pi, Raspberry Pi 2 Model B. And here we've got the new Broadcom system on chip. This is a quad core processor. And since they're four cores, you really get a lot more performance out of the board. In addition to the Broadcom chip upgrade, there's also an upgrade to the memory. The memory now is one gigabyte on the Pi, and this really allows for more concurrent processes to run and really provides an environment where you can use this as your desktop computer. So earlier today, I had a chance to run the Pi, and I was actually able to slice an STL file, browse to make zine, run GIMP, a photo editing software tool, play Minecraft, and have several terminal windows open monitoring the different cores on the Pi, and also the memory usage. I mean, you can't do that on any of the previous Pis, so this is really fantastic. The Raspberry Pi 2 Model B actually has the same form factor as the Raspberry Pi B+, which kind of can get a little confusing when you have both on your desk. But this is also great because all your cases that work for the B+, are going to work for this new Pi. So you really have forward compatibility with some of the accessories. You're probably wondering, do you need different peripherals to run this new Pi? The answer is yes, you need a different power supply. We suggest a power supply that delivers at least two amps to supply enough power for all four cores on the new chip. So that's a brief overview of the new Pi, and we're really, really excited about it at Make. But I haven't told you the best part. The best part is it's available right now and at the same amazing low price point. So grab one today, Share your projects with us, and we cannot wait to see what you make.